You know, my greatest dream for the oceans is that by the year 2050, we'll be able to rebuild our oceans to the abundance that my grandfather once knew when he first invented scuba diving. I think that science shows us that it's possible to accomplish this in one human generation, and that's what I will spend the rest of my life trying to achieve. We started our Oceans 2050 Foundation um, in partnership with Professor Carlos Duarte, who is the author of a landmark scientific study that was called Rebuilding Marine Biodiversity, Rebuilding Marine Life. And it shows us a roadmap, a scientific roadmap for how to rebuild ocean abundance by 2050. And that roadmap for me was a revelation because it was the first time that a scientist like Professor Duarte and his global network of scientists were able to demonstrate that it's still possible to rebuild the oceans that we've lost over the course of the past 50 years. So our foundation is all about taking that science and putting it into action so that we can create a pipeline of projects that will take us to an abundant ocean once again by 2050. My grandfather was Jacques Cousteau, and he was the director of this beautiful museum for over 30 years. And so when I was a little girl, seven, eight, nine years old, and was spending my summers here in the south of France, I would often come to the museum early in the morning before it opened to the public and meet my grandfather here. And we would feed the fish together and wander the museum together. And he would talk to me about the oceans and answer all of my questions and teach me things about stewardship and the extraordinary importance that oceans have for us and, and our lives and our societies and um, his dreams of being able to prevent the destruction of our oceans. And fortunately, he wasn't able to do that in his lifetime. We've lost ocean every year since he started scuba diving. But I think that we can now make that dream come true, hopefully in partnership with this beautiful institute that I've known since I was a little girl, and work to rebuild oceans in one human generation, um, following the legacy of my family and all the people that have worked so hard to protect our oceans.